Well, what is up, beautiful people of YouTube? My name is Yuri Tastic, and welcome back to another episode of Tropical 6 Sandbox Gameplay. A new episode, a new era, a new challenge is upon us. Already done two episodes, or two full seasons. The first season was 13 episodes, second season was 15. First season was I make everybody happy, have a normal island, which we did succeed in that. And the second episode was a military dictatorship, in my personal opinion, was a little bit disappointing. Now in this island today, what is the theme? Let's go ahead and list what we're aiming for this on this on this season. Now before we start, since it is the first episode is gonna be a little bit longer for the intro, so I can talk to you guys and make it clear what our goals, what are what we plan to accomplish this season. This season is basically gonna be all about money, 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 money. It's going to be about reaching, trying to reach 10 million to 15 million dollars in the bank easily with a successful economy and making the capitalist movement the prominent movement on the island. Usually we focus on a militarist or another kind of uh, faction, but today we're going to be focusing on the capitalist movement only. So that's number one. Number two, this means if we have to make somebody unhappy by pleasing them, we will. But if we can make everybody happy at the same time, we will take advantage of that as well. So that's the second rule of this island. The third rule of this island is we're not going to be necessarily trying to be a dictator but if we have to we will take that route however we're not going to be the extremely nice presidente nor we're going to be the extremely mean presidente we're going to be somewhere in the middle and last but not least when we talk about resources all of that here's what i got i got uh for resources got balanced we're not going to go completely because we are already done the whole poor resources last island we're going to go just in the middle we're not going to do filthy rich we're going to go balanced once again we're trying to have fun with this we're not really trying to challenge ourselves like we did last season we're trying to have fun with this and see how fast or how much money can we make with a stable successful economy as our main goal now a climate all this stuff is not normal we come in a political difficulty i did go ahead and put on demanding instead of fair we're not going to go aggressive we're going to go once again in the middle opposition difficulty we're going to put it on moderate it was reluctant at first we'll just leave it at moderate for now disasters i never really cared about so it's a rare if they happen then they happen starting money which a lot of you guys gotta be like oh why did you put that much once again we are trying to have fun with this so we put 150,000 at first but we do have the max population which makes it a little more difficult to start off with now with that being said if you play this game i always tell you guys this in my personal opinion from hundreds and hundreds of hours on tropical five and six from hundreds of episodes when you start at cold war it's much more challenging because a colonial you get to kind of build your island bit by bit by bit and in tropical six the more areas that you advance in the more they're gonna demand from you so when we start a cold war there's gonna be a lot that's gonna be unlocked but there's gonna be even more demands for like healthcare, education etc so on and so forth that are usually not there in the colonial era just yet so we decided to go with the cold war so that's gonna be the difficult challenge in it so there's some parts where it's gonna be difficult and challenging on purpose there's some part where it's not as challenging kind of to balance things out because like i said and i'm gonna keep repeating it our goal or our mission in here is to have fun but not make it super easy but at the same time not make it super difficult because we're already done the difficult island we're just trying to have fun here see how much money we can make see if we, how or how fast we can reach 10 million million in the bank while having a successful economy now let me go ahead and pick, pick an island and i'll be right with you guys in the game so here we are we got hit with that and that's exactly what i was telling you guys about when you advance you're already gonna get hit with with more options more things people expect from you as you can see right here these are constitution options that are all open for us that are generally in the colonial era we don't have to worry about just yet but right now we do so the first one i usually like all citizens vote so we're gonna go with that now the armed forces i was thinking about that i was thinking we we always go militia at least i always went militia uh this time i think i'm gonna go passive estate again maybe i regret this but down the road if need to be we can go ahead and switch it out now my question is if there is happens to be a rebel threat because it's decreased by 75 percent if there is a rebel threat what's going to happen to the to the island see that that's that's the problem disables all military buildings decreases the rebel threat build up by 75 so but okay there's 25 percent that might attack and once that 25 percent happens what's going to happen so let's come back to this one uh over here ecology i think i'm going to go with energy energy efficiency economy first decreases um 
increases the efficiency by 10 but the pollution by 50 to me the 10 50 ratio is not worth it because the 50 percent extra pollution might pollute your other resources or make other you know fertile places not fertile anymore so to me it's not even worth it uh, zero efficiency is also not worth it i'm gonna go with energy i mean zero emissions i'm gonna go with energy efficiency now we're gonna go separation of power we're gonna go ahead and put no separation we go back to this do we go pacifist or militia and this is a very very hard decision for me because i really want to try pacifist but at the same time if rebels attack what's gonna happen i gotta research this down the road once i research it we can always go pacifist but i'm gonna go with militia for right now with that being said the constitution is signed sealed january 1955 now let's take a look at the island okay we got very very wolf we got a very interesting flat island I mean, flat is nice, but there's really not much to it. And I've never seen this before. There's a dock and a street not connected to it by default. That is very, very strange. I don't know what's up with these red trees. It is the Chinese New Year as I'm playing this or Tropical has updated to it. And I'm not really feeling those red trees, to be honest with you. It doesn't look like an island at all. Um, not sure I feel that. Not sure I feel that, to be quite, quite honest with you guys. Okay, as you can see, we got more money because we have more population. But as you can see, all these shacks that have to be taken care of. So first order of business, let's get some shacks out and let's get some few things going here. Oh, I also put the, also put the Chinese New Year tree here. Just thought it was nice, you know, especially like a militarist island or a, sorry, a pacifist. Not a pacifist, a capitalist island with all the gold would look nice. So this is our, our castle or our palace right here. Where is El Presidente? Let me show you the guy. The palace is nicer than this place. <laughs> the palace is nicer than this place. I bet it is, Presidente. All right. Let's start it up, guys. Uh, first and foremost, we're going to go ahead and build another construction office. Anywhere really doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and put it here. Second order of business, we're going to go ahead and connect the dock, which is very, very strange. I've never had a, a tropical island where the dock was not really connected. So let's go ahead and do this. There we go. So the dock is connected. Um, we've got a um, construction office built. Construction office is very, very important at first because it's going to be basically, you're going to be building a whole lot of stuff at first. So that is very, very important. While that builds up, let's go ahead and start looking at some corn. Let's start looking at some other things. At this point, as I always tell you guys, at first, don't worry about where I'm zoning things because I always rearrange them. At first, we just want to zone them the closest things to our Teamsters and our dock, which we're going to do because we're not going to have the most docks or the most Teamsters at first. So it doesn't matter where we zone them at first. Don't stress about it. Before we zone them, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Um, let's take a look at uh, resources because I... Holy cow, there's a lot of resources in this island. What makes the Cold War so cold? Wow. Lack of love for El Presidente. Remember, That's why I don't like El having Presidente the in-game sounds sometimes because they're distracting. But tropical. there are a lot of resources on this island. Like really, really a lot. Coal is here. I'm not really worried about coal. We're already built on top of the coal, but that's fine. Um, so there's a lot of coal. Iron. There's a lot of iron. There's like about an average due deposits on each island. Gold. Three in the main, two. Whoa, there's a lot of there's a lot of resources. God. There are a lot of resources anyway, so that's good. I didn't expect so basically corn is good to build anywhere or to plant anywhere. Sugar is good. Cacao, tobacco, banana, pineapple, coffee, cotton, rubber, livestock conditions. So we're getting an average of yellow, greenish, uh, really anywhere. So let's go ahead and just start right here since there wasn't anything in this area. We're going to go plantation. And we're going to go with one and two corn. La, 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 la. And I do like the music. I decided to keep the music. Let me just double check before because I don't know if you guys know, know this. But if... Oh, no, no, no. We don't go main menu. I don't know if you guys know this. Um, only play straight. See, I didn't have it in. So this whole time I didn't have the stream safe music. So I might get copyrighted by this, but... Just keep in mind that you have that option in there. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just lower the voice volume so when they talk, uh, we can raise the FX volume. Okay. So I usually put my own background Tropic and music, but this time we decided to go ahead and just do it a little differently. So here we are. Here we are. And we're going to go and said we're going to do some sugar. Some sugar. 
very very excited for this hope you guys are excited as i am for it if you're new to the channel that's what i do man i do a lot of gta 5 videos a lot of tropical i love both of my tropical and gta 5 viewers that watch me because you guys are really really amazing make keep the channel going but i have a deep-seated root love for tropical this is think is my sixth season overall with tropical five and six that i've done all of them have been successful you guys seem to enjoy all of them and i'm very very grateful for that so let's go ahead and take a look at our apartment or tenement uh how much is the blueprint we're gonna need to get it out of either sooner or later we're gonna go ahead and just get a tenement out here in this area see i'm always confused with the tenement because like the front looks like the back and the back looks like the front sometimes the only thing that makes a difference is that there's like a dumpsters dumpsters in the back I don't see him now. Did they take him out? I don't know. But either way, I'm going to go build one and two. So here we are. The construction office is built and people got the jobs here. Let's go ahead and start getting things rolling. So got this and this. And as always, if you guys know who know how I play my game, you already know what industry is coming up next. We have to go with the rum distillery. That's the most one of the most stables industry. No blueprint for it. And it'll just get you started right right away. I don't like how close it is to where I'm going to be building houses, but I want it to be as close as possible to the sugar plantation. This way it can be even more f efficient. So we got that, got that. These are getting built. I don't really think it's a bad idea to go ahead and build another construction office just because of what we're doing right here right now. So let's go ahead and build that. I'm actually going to quick build it. Just lose that 1,000, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Once again, these are the, uh, this is the island. It's a custom island. Um, or I shouldn't say custom. I didn't make it. It's a self or automatically generated islands want to see something can you build a street like this okay cool so because bridges don't really go very far so like i don't think we could even build build a bridge from here to here can we because that's yeah that's one thing i don't like about this is the bridges don't always well maybe you could let's see maybe you could well maybe not i don't have no idea we'll about to find out some of these islands are not going to be connected by by uh, by a bridge so you gotta keep that in mind i think i think these two islands are not going to be connected to these three from what i think but nevertheless let's go ahead and get it started um come on construction people you guys are really not we're gonna go ahead and switch it to ignore safety regulation building is increased but uh each worker has risk of 10 percent of dying i'm sorry but we're gonna have to do that it's really really needed right now so that's built and and that's lovely all right and we're gonna have to eventually start looking at trade deals we have one available um might as well go ahead and buy two more for right now okay now we have three available because we're gonna need we're gonna need them sooner or later we will need them is there anything with corn no there is not now another thing to look at we are starting the cold war but one thing to look at also is look for import deals that are really good so you can export higher in this case there's nothing because we don't have any standings with anybody just yet so in this case there isn't really anything good or worth of having uh but with that being said let's go ahead and get a pirate cove So there's a pirate cove. We're gonna need that. We're gonna need that either way. And we'll just try to connect it to this street right here. There we go. So I'm not really worried really worried about it being built fast. I just want these things to get built up as fast as possible. So we can start at least having something here. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in a high priority as well. Uh they need to get it done. We have three construction offices, so it shouldn't really take this long, but you never know what tropical we got 214 dollars okay and then another rebel threat is low i'm not sure why that is that's very very unfortunate corn is now trending up okay that's good to hear because we have corn and we don't have a trade deal yet but i don't see any corn deals for us yet anyways um boy we'll go ahead and lock in this rum deal for right now because it's about to happen sooner or later and yes and the sugar deal will go ahead and lock in maybe too soon because i don't want to lock in 3600 units because i'm not sure how much of it is actually going to be to the rum distillery how much is going to go to the dock so let's see what they need here uh they need either bent uh build a convitello or produce chocolate uh i'm gonna have to go build a convitello i'm not really have anything so what's up what do you need 
for fair import with the Western powers. Okay. You want me to import something from, or import something to you? Okay. We're going to have to take something from them. I have to take something from them. Um, that's fine. We'll go ahead and do that. We'll t take a look at what they have for us. Okay, so they got something for us, thankfully. It's at less than 2%. I don't really need it, but at the same time, hey, it is what it is. I guess we'll make a 2% profit margin on it. So we'll go ahead and do it. It's going to make them happy. So we're going to be importing meat from them. Sign a contract, all them. 2,500 units shouldn't take that long, and I'll just make them happy. So it's a win-win, if you ask me. It really is a win-win. How are these? T did they get filled up? Okay, good. So not, not that much, but good enough for now. Let's go ahead and just build another block here. There's a lot of homeless people. There's a lot of homeless people. So a lot of you guys now get an idea why I decided to go with 150 at first. Because we have way more and I know this money is going to be blown up very, very fast. Um, like I said, I'm trying to, trying to have fun. I'm not trying to be stuck in a standstill where we're trying to do something uh, over and over and over and over again for God knows how many episodes. Uh, let's go ahead and get a house, get a house, and get a house. Okay, for right now, I'm going to chill in the housing. Okay, I'm going to chill on that. I'm going to start actually... Because it's got to be beneficial for our economy. I'm going to start looking at embassies here. Uh, although they are really expensive. But I'm just, I think all we need is two right now anyways. Because we're on the Cold War. We just need two embassies. So let's go ahead and get... I'm going to get one for now. I'm just going to get one for now. Um, and we'll go from there. Okay, so we're moving all this stuff around. Let's keep going. What else we can do? I think... One thing we're going to need is a grocery store for the people. Again, this is not a military dictatorship island. If there's something that the people, I feel like the people need, we'll go ahead and deliver on it. Uh, I hate how grocery stores are built up in this game. I really do. Because it's a front like this, but you're going to need a street from the side to go to it. So, but what are you going to do? Now that the war is over, what is going on? Lake Tropical Great. Unlimited greatness to the world. Okay. I am so excited. Okay. Borrow a major international landmark. Join a nuclear club. So that's gonna what's gonna take for us to get advanced to the modern times. We are going to establish tropical as a paradise for tourists. I like that. I like that last one because the last one means money. Kind of fits fits our plan for money. Uh we're gonna go for the last one. I never done it. Yes. We're gonna go for the last one. I like that. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Because, hey, tourism means money. Tourism means money. I showed you guys in Tropical 5 and Tropical 6, but Tropical 5 mainly, where we made like, what, 190000 a month from, from, from tourism? To tourism makes money. Got another demand. Decrease the unemployment by 7%. I like that demand. Oh, it's already increased? Okay, well, that's good. Produce uranium. Mm, I don't mind that at all. Anything that really... It has to do with money. I don't mind it at all. Um, but do we have uranium in the island is what I'm asking. I don't think uranium... Do we have some on the main island? Yeah, we do. Okay, sign me up. You want uranium? We got it. Shit, it makes us money. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, let's go. It's got to be food and resources. We do have an automatic mine. No, that's, that's modern times. Okay, so let's just do a regular mine. And there you go. There's your, there's a uranium, uranium uh, mine you want. Yeah, anything's gonna make us money. I'm cool with that. I am cool with that. It's uh, private. I mean, uh, Swiss banks, Swiss bank dollars or Tropican dollars. I am all right with that. How, how are we doing here? Okay, we got good things coming. Good things coming. All right, here comes a ship. Did they change the ship? The ship looks a little different. Alright, cool. Meat is here too, so it's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. Let's take a look at our trade deals. How much how much meat was that? That was one thing. So yeah, like it, this should be done pretty quick. And I think what we can have two thousand, ten immigrants or random blueprint. I'm probably gonna take the two thousand right now. We're at a protest. We have a protest already? What do you guys need? A president people are angry, not a youth course, but what they have promised to raise fun happiness by eight next two years. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. We need it. We need it. So you guys have you guys have a solid point. Thank you for reminding me. But just calm down a little bit. We literally started this island 15 minutes ago. Uh, who do I take? Who do I take? I think I'm gonna go with the Western powers. So far, they have been the, 
the generous ones. Now remember guys, praising in Tropical 6 is going to cost you 5000 so just hang on on that. Don't praise nobody just yet. I'm not trying to spend $5,000 to make somebody happy and see him that I praise them. So we're going to hang on on that real quick. Oh boy, we have wildfires. The price of good minerals have increased by 15. Oh man, where is the where is the wildfire? A listener wrote in asking, how do I know if my neighbor is a spy? The I don't know. Doesn't show me. Spy on everyone. Does not show me. It looks like corn is up. Um, import offer. Let's see. I don't want 79% above. Get the hell out of here, Mexico. Mexico always does does me dirty in this game, man. Mexico always does me dirty. We still have no corn deals. Um, yeah, it is what it is. I think we already have a rum deal taking place right now. We still obviously haven't pr produced anything yet because there they are right here. Oh, there's some rum, but it hasn't really produced it. So let's go ahead and raise the efficiency on this or the budget on this to raise the efficiency. And let's go ahead and start looking at another possible uh, possible thing we can build. I, I'm thinking I'm thinking a good one to build right now is going to be the... Well, before we build another team, sirs, let's go ahead and give them some entertainment. We'll go ahead and give them a tavern here, no problem. Again, a tavern, let's think it goes this way. We'll give them one right here. In front, front of the embassy so our, our visitors could come drink. And we can go ahead and eventually, we're going to eventually have to do it. Unlock. How much is a restaurant? 650. And how much is a circus to unlock? 1200. Let's go with a restaurant for now. And we'll put it right here. There we go. There we go. So that's done and that's done. Shouldn't take forever. We have enough construction offices here and they're not even that big of a building for them to take that long anyways. Alright, we got a restaurant and that built. Remember, I would drop down from 18 to 13, so that's not very good for the fun happiness over here. So that's not the best news you want to hear, to be honest with you. That is not the best news you want to hear. But it is what it is. Housing, like I said, we're gonna... Oh, they actually got filled up. This didn't get filled up. This didn't get filled up. So tenement seems to be the popular one. Man, I really don't like how much money I'm spending on housing this early, but... It's alright. It's alright. Let's go ahead and get another one. Let's get another one up. There we go. So pretty good, pretty good. Making progress. But I don't really like just having the rum distillery. I think we need like one more or something. We should get one more. Let's take a look at our our money here. Treasury. So expenses 35. But remember it counts construction. Which I don't understand and miscellaneous stuff like blueprints and all that. So uh, I don't like that it counts. I wish there was an option to turn that off. But export is not really doing the best. Corn is obviously going up because it is trending in general. Local services. I think rent is going to be it. If, uh, rents. Yeah. Well, rent is doing us good. Okay. Good to hear. Good to hear. So we're making some money back from the rent. So that is very good to hear. Now, I, the whole when there's a demand to raise something to a certain point in Tropical Six, it has always been super, super, super annoying because you just like you can do whatever you can do, it is still not enough. Like you know, for an island of 229 people, what am I? How many things can I have? There's a restaurant, there's a tavern. I'll, I'll go ahead and build a circus just so we can win this. And again, we're not really losing at the end of it. Uh, or maybe botanical garden doesn't sound bad. Actually, that does not sound bad at all. Uh, let's go with the botanical. Again, what's the front? Where's the front for this? There's a front. There has to be a front. I don't know. I really hate to put it up in the front. It's like somewhere else. Okay, let me let me go out of here. Um, we already bought it, so let's go ahead and extend this out a little more. Nope, did not want to do that. Let's go ahead and extend it out a little more. There. Oh my god, again. Nope, did not want to do that. I'm trying to keep them straight for right now as much as possible. We're just wasting money on this. Straight, straight, Jurtastic. There you go. Okay, so that's done. Botanical Garden. Can we please for the life... Oh my god, for the life of me, I can't figure out which, which way is straight here. I think this way. It's not this way. 
Or maybe they come this way from the front. Yeah, I think it's... I think this is the front and they go in the back. Well, you know what? The hell with it. If we don't get it right, then we don't get it right. It is what it is. So this is getting built and it's already getting filled up. I like that. I like to see that. Let's go ahead and get this built up quick. Nice. So we already have about 9,000 expected revenue. I like to see that. Really, really do like to see that. Uh, we have some raid points taking place, so let's go ahead and just get some... Mm, let's just get some regular stuff for now. Nothing crazy. Just regular resources, so we can just put them back in our dock and not really losing anything on it. Research. We don't have any research points because we don't have anything generating research points. That's something we'll look at possibly in the next episode. I'm not going to look at it right now, to be honest with you guys, because as you can see, I'm busy trying to do things here and there and there. Um, now, this one, Uranium, it says the deposit is... Oh no, that's the output. How much deposit do we have? So we have 79,000, so it should be very, very good for us. What do you need? You I'm not... Toil in this man's evil factories. So oh boy. You know, Sister Francisco, I'll go ahead and build a hospital. I'm not building a nuclear program anytime soon. I am not building that anytime soon. But the problem with the hospital, you're going to need electricity, which we don't have. So this, this probably is going to get timed out. Honestly, she's going to be mad at me, but it is what it is. And now he comes and tells me I have a circus. Seriously, dude? After I build the botanical garden? I'm not really trying to spend that much money and on just like entertainment stuff at first. I think we did it right. Yeah, this is the big... I think it's the front. It should be. Should be the front. Alright, cool. So we'll just add a circus a little later, but for right now, we're just gonna have to go with this. We're gonna have to go with this. Meat is done. Alright, so they like that. We'll wait for them to see what they got. We gotta go take the 2,000, of course. And let's see. So meat is done. We made actually 2% profit on the whole 2,500 units that we got. So it's not really that bad. Um, so right here. Nothing good yet because, again, our standings are not the best uh, for import. But let's say, let's see for export. export. We have anything export good that we can give them. You guys really want that cigar stuff, huh? I'll go ahead and do it. I'll sign it. That's gonna be our next. Uh, that's gonna be our next uh, mesh mission here. Let me just double check here that we're not gonna build on top of anything. Uh, resources, so there's nothing here. So we'll go ahead and build the tobacco factory, uh, tobacco plantations, and the cigar factory in this area. There we go. Let's go ahead. Tobacco, hopefully, oh, tobacco is perfect here. Okay, good to hear. Good to hear. Bam. Oh, whoa, no, 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 did not want to abandon. I was just trying to build a plantation. And... Bam. All right, so that's done. Now let's go ahead and put the cigar factory in front of it. That's going to probably bring us down a little bit in money, but it is what it is. 3,000 to that and 13,000 to build it. Oof, that's that's a spendy, spendy cigar factory, isn't it, boys? Isn't it? I want to thank you guys once again for tuning in, man. Really, really appreciate you sticking by the, my tropical series, all of them. Really, really do appreciate it. It's always a reminder and always an option for you to go ahead and hit the like button if you like what you're seeing and join the J Army if you like what you're watching in general, man. Like I said, well, that's, this is what we do, man. We have fun, we just chill, lay back. Play some tropical. Try to make it entertaining for you guys. Try to have a purpose, a mission to my islands. Not just build, build, build. You know, sometimes it's fun to do that. But right now, I don't feel like doing that. I, I like to have a specific a specific uh, thing to it. So, meat is trending up. Probably doesn't hurt to get a meat one. Man, like, all of these entertainment buildings and it's 15 now. We're not even anywhere near where we want to be. And it's getting kind of annoying, to be honest with you. It is getting kind of annoying. So, the wildfires have helped the meat. Um... We're gonna need meat. We're gonna need meat sooner or later, so might as well put a start doing some stuff right now with the meat as well. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and build a, put a teamster's office though somewhere around here. We'll put it right here by the by the uh, by the port. How much is this? Five hundred. Let's go ahead and start putting parking garages around here as well. Just just kind of spread things around a little bit, and we'll put one. 
I don't want to buy the palace per se. Let's put it right here. There we go. So that's getting built. That's getting built. Of course, the main mission right now is to get those built up. So let's go ahead and put this in high priority. And meet now. Ah, uh, boy. Let's see. Where do want to? Where do want to put our meat? Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, meat, meat, meat. Of course, we're not really. Put one right here. What about pigs? And uh, llamas. No goat. No is. Uh, let's go with cattle. Just regular cattle. The efficiency is 77% because it's not all the way green. But it is what it is. I'm actually going to go ahead and quick build these. That's alright. Let's take a look at our employment. Unemployed citizen 61. So we want to be a little more. We want to be careful here. Um, homeless families is on, is on a decline as well. So that's very, very nice to see. Very nice to see. Now, entertainment has been the biggest pain in the butt so far because we've done all these things and it's still not really, they're not really liking it. Court is no longer trending. Okay, that's not a problem. I think these are new actually because I didn't see them before. Um, or maybe I didn't have them enabled before. Who knows? All right, last but not least, I feel like my hands are tied in this one. I, I have to do it sooner or later. Let's go ahead and build the circus. Let's go ahead and just do it. I... Uh, since Penultima also asked for that, you know, uh, oh man, it, it is what it is, it is what it is, that's all I'm going to say. So here's a circus, hopefully it gets up, we have about two years left to, through, a, little, a little bit over two years left to fulfill the demand, and as you guys can see, the demand is going very, very, very slow. Very, very slow. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed episode one of Tropical Six Sandbox Gameplay, The Capitalist Island. Now... We've done we've done a lot. We have two industries going. Our regular usual suspects, the cigar and the rum distillery. We have the uranium de deposit. We got actually decent amount of uh, entertainment buildings. We got an embassy built, and we also have Western powers here that like us. We got a grocery store. We got to focus a little bit on generating research points the next episode, and maybe start with the health department. But also at the same time, we don't want to be too crazy, uh, and we might build another embassy embassy next episode as well, uh, so that could help us out with uh, better deals with uh, with the Eastern Bloc. So as always, guys, thank you very much from the bottom of my heart for watching. I hope to see you guys on the next episode. My name is Jurtesic, and I am out.